What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Lugnut TV with Jesse G, a channel for lug nuts all about the brand Lug. In this video, we're going to be unboxing the sixth ever, I can't believe we are on box six already, Lug Life Box, and the second ever in the holiday edition. Last year, the theme was Buffalo Check Red. We've got snowflakes on the front, and on the back is their new plaid print. Every time I think we're done, we are not. Gosh, we're gonna get right into it because I am so excited. Okay, we're not gonna get right into it. We're gonna get right into it. Pull things out one by one from underneath the paper or lift the entire sheet. Hmm, hmm. I made a decision. Oh, look at this Christmas card. This is adorable. So inside this card, the actual card itself, we have coupons. We love to create and listen to all the feedback we get from you and we appreciate it so much. We value your enthusiasm, comments, love, and support for the brand and are so grateful that it has grown into such a passionate love nut community. We packed this box perfectly with pockets and patterns galore, plus a few accessories to share, keep, and explore. This is going to rhyme. A holiday box from Lug would not be complete without a classic game for the family to gather and compete. Sharing the laughter and love with your family and friends is the best gift possible to mark the year's end. So now as we march into 2022, already? Okay. A year so bright, we wish you health, happiness, wonder, and delight. I'm glad I stopped to read this. That was cute. You know what? That's gonna go there for now. I don't know. Can you just, can you just sit? Be right back. Can you just put it here? Ah, there we go. Okay. Can you, can you stay? Oh, that's so cute. Okay. What is this? What is this? What is this? Rummy bento? Okay, what's inside? Oh my gosh, what is happening? No way, playing cards, oh my gosh. I'm never opening these. These are a treasure. Hang on, hang on. It's like Christmas at the casino. They really did put a whole board game in here. For anybody who might lose theirs and want to see a copy of this, I will post a picture of this on Lugnut TV Instagram. We gotta open this. What in the world? I am not going to stop to figure out what exactly this is during this video, but I will post an update. Wow, I don't even, I don't even, where do I start? You guys go back in here, go back in here, keep this together because later I'm gonna wonder where the instructions are. I didn't do that right. What is this? Christmas cards! This is great because I didn't buy Christmas cards this year. Everybody is getting a love Christmas card this year. Oh, what is this? Oh, okay. Each one comes with its own little envelope inside of the card. These are timeless, right? So even if you don't use them this year, just save them for next year. These are really cute. Okay, there's this big trolley right in the front here. So we have seen this. So you get your XL trolley. So for those who are new here, this is like a cosmetics organizer. Shaving kit organizer, whatever you want to use it for. This would be good for big pieces. And then in here, we've got the parasail, which is completely plastic lined. So if you get anything messy spilt in here, it wipes up really easily. So it's not a completely new item. We have seen this, but it's such a nice extra to get this in the box because I never don't need a trolley, never. I use them for everything. I don't just organize them for bathroom stuff, right? I use them for organizing our homeschool areas. When we go on vacations or road trips, I give each of my kids one of these. They bring their own little toys and they just fill it up and organize it however they want to. And they know that they are responsible for their own trolley, right? You can put snacks in here, Legos, small toys, Hot Wheels cars. What is this? What is this? Landing pad? Coasters! They got like this board inside. They're structured coasters, like the bottom of Lug's bags. I love this so much. I think this is in the freestyle fabrication. I guess you could get these wet and it would be fine. It would probably dry really easily. You get good distance with these too. Little uh, 
landing pad frisbees. Looks like there's two things left and I'm excited about both of them because they look like full-size bags. Let's start with this one, Tropical Multi. This is the Navigator, the Navigator. I love a top handle, double pockets. Oh, and this one comes with the water bottle holder. Look, water bottle it goes right there. You can carry a water bottle on the side of your bag. So for any newcomers, to this channel, to the Lug brand in general. Lug often includes these hideaway water bottle holders on the sides of their bag. When you're not using it, you just snap it back together and then it just stays closed flush against the side of your bag. And when you need to carry a bottle of water, it's there. Okay, at the top, we have the cell phone pocket, which is soft line. On the back, there is a slip pocket with a magnetic closure at the top, magnetic, it's a nice size. You get this whole area here for that pocket. So the compartment in front of the handle, we've got the strap. On the front wall, there is a large clear view pocket. And that pocket extends from wall to wall. On this side, we've got the stretchy key bungee. On the back, look at all the organization they put in here. Two pen holders next to a soft line stretchy cargo pocket. This is honestly my kind of bag. I'm guessing the back here, could you fit a tablet in that? I'm not sure. It's a little squishy. You know what this is? This is basically an east-west compass. And I happen to have a compass right here. So this is the compass. You've got two pockets on the front and then on the back you've got a north-south pocket for a tablet. That's kind of what I'm feeling here, except east-west. North-south, East, West, please stop it. When we're finished with this, I'm going to grab my iPad 10.4 inch and see if it fits in the back easily. I think this is the last item it is. This is called the Soar. Oh, okay. I'm getting major Presto and Allegro vibes right now because of the flap and the cell phone pocket on the back. Also, it feels very structured, but listen, this flap, unlike the flap on the Allegro and the Presto does not cover the whole front of the bag. So it closes with a hidden magnet. It stays open by itself. Also, I think it's important to note that this flap is not heavy. This is not gonna add a ton of weight to the bag. It is a little bit structured. On the inside, there is no additional opening. There's no zipper or anything. Once you open the flap, you're already in the bag. So we've got our strap here. They gave us some paper. Oh, we've got two straps, hang on. Okay, let's look at the interior first. Look at how pretty that lining is. Two zip pockets, okay? So we've got a privacy zip pocket on the back. Beneath that, two stretchy cargo pockets. Those are not soft lined. On the opposite wall, the second zip pocket is a clear view pocket. And this here is a second strap. This one is a chain strap. So we've got a shoulder strap here. And you know, the first thing I'm thinking when I'm looking at this is, while I have this on my shoulder, is my hair going to get caught in this? This has some nice substance to it. These links are also flat here on the front and the back. So this is gonna lay nice and flat. Now I see a lot of people buying straps for their lug bags from other sites, uh, especially from Amazon. Maybe they're wanting to dress up their bags a little bit more. So it's nice that lug is including another option for a bag that looks and feels a little bit dressier. So if you wanted more of an everyday casual look, they still include the regular crossbody strap. But if you wanted to go a little crazy, get dressed up. This chain, listen, I can't get enough of this chain. I really actually do like this. I'm gonna put my hair all over this chain. Okay, let's, let's put the chain on top of the hair too. Okay, because this is, a, this is a real thing for a lot of people. Because all of a sudden when you pull this off, and your hair's coming with it, it hurts, right? It didn't happen just then. I, I mean, I feel like if it was gonna happen, it would just happen. It's not really when you pull the bag off, it's when you go to flip your hair back and you feel that it's caught, okay? Nothing. I mean, maybe I got lucky, but honestly, it didn't get caught. I don't know how they did that, but that's pretty amazing. There's also a board on the bottom of the bag to give you a little bit of structure here. So it's a nice, sleek, clean look. They've got their newer logo here, which matches the chain. Your cell phone pocket, which is soft lined on the back. This is really nice and really dressy. I don't go anywhere fancy, but I'm ready. Yeah. Fancy bag with two straps. Mini Frisbees slash 
coasters. Christmas cards. Our board game, which came in a large bento box. Where did my stuff go? The three-piece trolley set. Guys, this box was full of stuff, okay? And a second handbag. They gave us two handbags and a trolley set. Think about it. If you got this box and you decided, oh, Listen, uh, of all this stuff, there's only one bag I really like. I only really want to keep this one. Holiday gift to somebody else. If you're like, oh, I don't know what to get this person. Give them a love bag. I mean, change their whole life, basically. My opinion, the value on this box was incredible. It was absolutely worth every penny. I feel like I got more, absolutely, than what I paid for. And that doesn't even include the fact that later on I can use coupons for future purchases. So normally I just like to ask everybody else what they're thinking. This time I feel like I just had to say something. Uh, Lug really went above and beyond this time. They've completely filled this box with just big value items. But go ahead and comment below what you think about this box, what was inside, the whole theme in general, and whether or not you picked one up. Before we go, let's check out if the iPad fits. So this is a 10.4 inch with a slim keyboard case. It fits perfectly. Listen, I already love it. I love this because I love anything that gives me a separate iPad compartment. If you're new here and you want to see more videos like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Thanks so much for watching and like always, I'll see you guys next time. Box of Christmas. I just dropped them on the ground. Turn on.